Jamie called us uh, yesterday and wanted us to try to figure out if her husband is messing around. Uh, she's seven months pregnant. Um, you got Valentine's Day right around the corner. He's been acting all sorts of distant. Uh, he's been away, said he's not going to be back for Valentine's Day, been hanging out with friends, gets too drunk to come home, um, too drunk to Uber, huh? So every instinct that Jamie has here is saying that her husband is messing around. So she wanted our help trying to catch him last night. All right, Jamie, we're not going to put this uh, off any longer. Are uh, you ready for the results from last night? Yes. Okay. All right, so, um, yes, Bert? You want to explain? For those that don't know what the War of the Roses digital thing is all about. So, yeah, for To Catch a Cheater, we have multiple options here, and we opted to go with our digital War of the Roses, and we got her husband's email. We got Jamie's husband's email, and we sent him a uh, promotional email for a new florist that's in town offering him free flowers um, and nine times out of ten they take us up on the offer and they send the flowers and then obviously whoever they send the flowers to and what's in the note what's on the card speaks volumes of where the relationship stands so that's exactly what we did jamie you gave us his email um we reached out to him about it being a new local florist and offering him a a free bouquet he was able to choose from the following bouquets because we have noticed that you know having a choice that The type of bouquet speaks volumes, too. So, there was heart's desire. Remind her of your love with these two dozen long stem red roses. Perfect Valentine bouquet for the only one your heart wants. Then she had what in the carnation? The sweetest mix of red, hot pink, and light pink carnations. Uh, If there's a little Valentine in your life, show her you care with this precious bouquet. Uh, We also had, oh, for suck's sake. This is a new one. A beautiful assortment (laughs) of succulents. A practical Valentine gift that keeps growing like your love, unless you're Davi, and then you kill them. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, hey. Sorry for bringing up the past. (laughs) And then simply, (laughs) simply irresistible. A vase filled with nothing but midnight blue irises. It's a bold statement for an even bolder lady. Um, we sent the promotional email at 11.15 a.m. yesterday, and he replied just 20 minutes later. So he was on it, and he did pick Heart's Desire, and that's the two dozen long stem roses. Um, the note on the card said, Will you be my Valentine? And... Jamie, I am so, so sorry. He's asking some woman by the name of Jennifer to be his Valentine. I don't know if you have any idea or any inclination of who this is, but I'm really, really, really sorry. Okay, thank you. Is there anything to the note on the card or anything that might give her any more indication, or is that all she needs to know? No, I told her the note. The note said, will you be my valentine? Oh, okay. That's all it said. So, I I mean, I think your instinct was right on here. I can't think of worse timing than this. Um, We do have the home address of the woman. So, I mean, we can give you that information. So, if you want to do any digging and try to figure out who this is, um, of course, you're well within your right to do that. We'll pass on all this information to you. But, um, yeah, he he sent him for Valentine's Day. Okay. Wow. All right. I know this is super, super painful, so we're just we're going to let you go. Um, and, and if there's anything that we can do to help out, if you need any, you need to know the address or anything like that, please reach out to us, and uh, we'll provide you anything that you can. Cassie wants to say something here, though. What's I up? do, too. My heart is breaking for you. This is such a tough time in your life, and having a new baby isn't easy. So if you need help, um, I just had a baby a year ago. I can talk you through stuff. I want to be here to be a support person for you. So if you need anything... Tommy can give you my contact info, and you reach out, okay? I mean it any time of day. That's so sweet. Thank you. All right, Jamie. We'll let you go. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. Here, Bird Show.